Hey guys, what's up, Sinji here, and we're getting straight into this one. This one's going to be last Titan standing for you guys. First of all, let me just say, we're starting out with a disadvantage in this game. Obviously, they've got a full six-man team. We have a three-man team, and then one random on our team, so 6 v 4 at the minute. And this is going to be round one, so we're going to start with the disadvantage and see what we can do. Now, the other things to point out in this, when you look at the leaderboard, they're actually a full clan, guys. That's right, you heard me right, they are a full clan. Excuse me a second. <coughs> Sorry about that, I got really dry throat today for some reason. Okay, so basically all I'm doing here is just adding some extra damage. You can see Grimm's at the back of him and we're just going to Titan punch him. He's gone into the nuke jet, so we're just going to get away. We're not going to worry about the pilots that are on the ground, because if they do rodeo us, we're going to be so close to each other that we can just take them out on our backs. Okay, so we know there's a human pilot on that roof, that's why we're just being careful before we go into this. Place the cluster, get a perfect cluster hit there. Obviously, this guy's been hit big time. Unfortunately, I get hit by... What I think was either an art mine or an art grenade. He's just tried the same thing to me, but he missed with his cluster, and I've missed with my cluster in return. But we just get some big damage, we're gonna make sure he can't take us out there. And we was gonna go for the auto widget kill, but unfortunately, it was the end of the round. Right, we are moving into round two, guys. As we're moving into the round 2, this time I opt to go left side. As I'm going left side, I'm just going to pause here, and as you see, right there. There you go, got eyes on me. I'm just going to place the cluster there, just so three of them can't double back on each other without getting damaged, as you can see that. Now, they've made one big mistake. They're not challenging me. And that allows me to just pick off random damage. That's the good thing about the art cannon. You can just pick random damage at random times. And you can back off and you can keep all of your health nice and well intact. And it's also good when you're in a strider. And you basically got a one-on-one -on -one battle as well. So we're going to punch him straight back. And you know what? This guy wants a punching game. We'll give him a punching game. Ah, oh, bro, I'm coming for you. And we get the squeeze. Right, so two of them right over here. This cluster's going to do major damage right now. So all I need is one hit on this guy. Oh, he moved, he moved. Where is that? Right, he's at this right-hand side right there. We're going to punch him, take down his shield. And there we go, he's into a jet mode. So that was Titan Eddie NL. Okay, my titan's been taken out, and I'm just going to crush that pilot before I end up ejecting. Which works out quite well. And there you go, we end up with the round win. You can see on the scoreboard there. Round 2 down. <coughs> right, we are moving into round 3. Okay, so we opt for the same side, and they're not actually going this side this time, they've chosen to go down the left. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to work on the flank, but unfortunately there is a Titan directly in the middle. So I'm just going to see if I can take him out, just nice and easy. Oh, he's got the plasma railgun. This is perfect for a one-on-one -on -one situation. Um, obviously the plasma railgun, you're going to see the amount of damage he manages to do to me. Look at this. I can just play with him, left, right, left, right, bunny hop, bunny hop. Duck, 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 punch. <laughs> He's really trying to get me, bro. Come on, bro. Hit something. <laughs> Hit me with your rhythm stick. 
There we go, and he's forced to eject. Okay, so that's the good thing about the plasma railgun. If you come up in a one on one situation and you've got an art cannon, they have to be very good with the weapon, otherwise, you're going to take them out nice and easy. And you can see me take out the human player who's trying to get revenge on me on the roof. Right, now what we're going to do is we're going to help out our team and find anywhere where they need help. But unfortunately, they don't. And Boss Monster is going on an absolute rampage at the minute with 9 Titan kills. Right, we are moving into round 4 guys. Okay, so as we're moving into round 4, what we're going to do is we're going to go straight down the middle. Right here. We're going to place that cluster directly through. Just in case anybody comes that way. And then we're going to check here. Oh, that's where they are. Now the reason we use the smoke lure is because one of them brought up the particle wall which is going to blur their vision so they're going to have to blind fire through. You can see he's starting to attack which is why I back off there and I'm going to use this little part, boom, and he's just ejected which is a very bad move. We're just going to punch him and we actually end up stepping on him by accident but that gives us a free titan kill right there. Now let's see if the Auto Titan can hit me more than that player did. Nope. Right, so obviously he's using the Vortex Shield but with the reflective bullets. Whenever people are using that, what you want to do is you want to back off, wait for it to run out of charge and then attack. Using the dash car there just to get away from the nuke eject, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to come round straight into their spawn. You can see him right there, I've got an enemy pilot that's locking on me constantly, so where is that? Because he's chasing me down. There he is, he's on the roof up here. So, even though he's on the roof, he's managed to take my Titan down, so well played to him. But what I'm going to do, one, two, find out where he's gone, he's actually moved over to the other building. Now this is where I completely fail here guys, I was actually trying to get on top of the roof. Now you can see obviously you can wall hang on the grids but unfortunately it didn't work out. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe guys and peace out.